And how well played. Again, Bogdan. Emphatic. What a start for Bogdan. Sight there, break point for Bogdan. And again, Bogdan breaks. Post giver's resistance Bogdan is short lived. Two games to one. Well, Bogdan knows this match is on a racket. She keeps breaking Bose Giver, but in this second set, Bogdan just cannot back it up. Yes, played well there. Though. And Postgiver hits the front. She's finding something here. Oh, it's a brilliant pass down the line for Bogdan. She has the mini break. And Bogdan puts her place in the quarterfinals here in Osaka, and she can scarcely believe it, there is delight all around. It's another straight sets win for Anna Bogdan. A remarkable week in a remarkable match as well. She utterly dominated set one. Postgiver didn't have a look in. Set two was nervy, it was caging. Bogdan needed the tie break and she won it. But Burrell only needs to. Yeah, just let Burrell off the hook there, Mertens. Yeah, that's better from Burrell. Just taking that point to Mertens. Love putting. Oh, what a backhand. Well, <laughs> astonishing point. The most important service game coming up now for Burrell in this match. Oh, that is some forehand down the line.
from Burrell. Mertens again, just too passive. Well, now then, what a chance this is. Uh, a run to the title by now Habino in 2019. Neatly put away. Carefully constructed points. Clever. Yeah, just peppering that corner. Mm -hmm. Good win for Burrell on the, the previous match here. Very good. Oh, it's an absolutely terrific rally. Oh, so good. I mean, the quality of the, the striking has been immaculate. Oh, it's terrific play from both. And it goes. And a wide smile for Sarah Saito. What a victory that is. And for the 18-year-old, home hope here in Japan. A spot in the quarterfinals. And Japan, they will have two players in the last eight here in Osaka. Brilliant win, 7-6, 6-4. The previous. Yeah, well played. The previous four I was talking about for Parry, the Excellently done. We'll see in the start uh, moment of sheer frustration. Beautiful. Really good. Yeah, built that point nicely and sets up set point event in Charleston. The 
Min and serve has been broken a couple of times. Oh no, second juice game. Oh, winner. Well, nothing she could do about that. Can't reproach yourself there. Yeah, better. Needs to do more of that, doesn't she? She gets one break back, then it might become a little edgy. But still match point. And the third match point is enough. Minen protests that it was into the sidelines. No overall for the chair. And the match is decided. Not in controversy, I don't think. Because Tian Parry was the better player today and deserves to take her place in the last eight. It'll be a 10th career WTA quarterfinal for Dian Parry. Never been even a finalist in an event at 250 or higher. But what a chance she has in this tournament now. The first seed into the quarterfinals of the Japan Open, winning four and two against Greek Minen.